yeah, welcome to McCola's, aka McDonald's, where tonight we are making the low calorie Big Mac. Big Mac, but low calorie, meaning the Big Nick. <laughs> hey McDonald's, you got the Big Mac, we got the Big Nick. We got the Big Nick. What do you think about that? And we're not McDonald's, we're McCola's. <laughs> Copycat Big Mac, but low calorie. Let's go. Two beef patties, but turkey patty, special sauce, pickles, yeah. And a toasted sesame bun. <laughs> but we didn't toast it. <laughs> we didn't toast it because the picture looked better. Guys, I am so excited to share this with you. We, everyone loves fast food, including Kyle and I. And you guys always say, don't you get cravings? What do you do? Yeah, we get cravings. Then we take all of our favorite food and we make low calorie versions so that we can stay on track, stay in our calorie deficit, lose weight, but eat great. So we're getting into this. This is the Big Mac, low calorie. We did everything as close as possible and made it taste very, very close. So the first thing we're gonna start with, buns. Now we found low calorie Ooh. beams, buns. Two different things. <laughs> so we wanted to get the sesame bun. So this, we got all these things from Walmart and these are brioche sesame burger buns. And it's 160 calories for one bun. But of course the Big Mac has three to lower the calories, we found these. These are the Great Value Hamburger Buns, and these are 120 calories for a whole bun. So we took the bottom part of that and this to make way lower calories in buns. Because everybody knows you need that sesame top for the Big Mac. Yeah, so we had to get the two different buns to keep the calories low, but keep it as close to the Big Mac as we could. Because a lot of people on YouTube try to do copycat, low calorie, anabolic stuff, but it yeah. tastes like crap and it's not it's you gotta get it as close as you can not make craps make colas make yummy and to make the special sauce lower calorie we found this great value thousand island dressing we couldn't find a light version but one tablespoon is 40 calories and that's all we needed was one tablespoon for the whole thing so the first thing we did was we used ground turkey instead of beef and we measured out the ground turkey raw and we did two ounces per patty. We made two of them, super, super flat, as thin as you can make it. And Sassy's got the best tip ever. You take your thumb and you make an indent, this is my example, like this in the middle and it stops the burger from becoming a ball when it cooks up. So preheated the frying pan on medium heat, sprayed it with cooking spray, and then we cooked those for three minutes per side, and we put some sea salt and pepper on as much as you want. Because the meat is plain, like we're not seasoning the meat, so you gotta be generous, don't be afraid of salt. Be very, very generous with the salt on the one side, salt and pepper, because yeah. it needs it, trust us. It will be, so much more flavorful if you do that. So the sea salt and pepper, then this is how we top it. Okay, you start with the bottom bun of the sesame variety. Then, you're gonna see my eyes go like down because I wrote it down because I don't, I might forget. We so, got B-roll luckily enough to cover up the eye diversion. Oh yeah, so <laughs> B-roll in sass. Okay, <laughs> so bun half a tablespoon of the Thousand Island. Then you do the, I'm cheating. Then you do the cheese, then the lettuce, then a burger, okay? Then you're gonna put the middle bun from the lower calorie burger bun. Then we did onion. Sorry, I lied. After the burger, you put onion, then the middle bun, half a tablespoon of the Thousand Island, more lettuce, 
then the sliced pickles and you gotta slice them and then you put the other burger then your onion and then you top it with the sesame top now McDonald's toasts theirs Mick Cola's does not toast the bun <laughs> we were thinking we're like I don't know they say they toast it but when you eat a Big Mac the bun doesn't really taste that toasted so no. we figured it would look better for the picture and we also were copying like we tried we went online and looked and did oh, our yeah. best to make it look as big and as beautiful as the Big Mac even though when you go to McDonald's now it's a very small Big Mac but yeah but ours still, is way better ours I can't believe how close we made it look and it seriously tasted like so close I would say a seven to eight out of ten like very close the turkey is slightly different but wow we got it pretty close if you and pan fry it like we're showing you in salt and pepper the top you got to get that pan nice and smoke and hot though before yes. you put the patty on because you need the flavor turkey's very lean oh yeah oh yeah and I just remembered a tip so the burgers are so thin that it was really hard for me to kind of scrape them so they put them on a piece of wax paper and i found instead of using a lifter to lift them off they were starting to break i literally just took the wax paper and i flipped the burgers into the pan and it worked so if your burgers are super thin try that it works i'm like chef coolest ho 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 karate style Okay, now listen to this. This is the PS de resistance. A Big Mac for calories. Listen, this is so... Okay, a Big Mac calorie-wise from McDonald's. 570 calories, 32 grams of fat, 47 carbs, and 27 grams of protein. Listen to the low calorie version that we made at McCollins. And we're being honest, guys. We're not going to say that it tastes the same. We're not. It's not a 10 out of 10 exactly like a Big Mac. Honestly, though, you guys know we know our food. It, guys. It is a seven to eight out of 10. It's amazing. If you're looking for a, to get out your fast food craving and you're not ready to have like a cheat meal or whatever, and you want to stay in your calorie deficit, like. It's totally worth it. So this is the calories of ours. 447 calories, 46 carbs, 15 grams of fat, and 35 grams of protein. So you're saving 123 calories, 17 grams of fat. And if you look at the and size of our Big Mac, it's an actual Big Mac. It's actually, you're gonna get way more food and be way more full with ours. And guess what? You're adding 11 grams of protein, way less fat, more protein, and you're lowering it by 123 calories. You're gonna feel way more full, you're gonna feel satisfied, and it will get out your Big Mac craving. And it what's, is the, so good. what's the fat we're lowering it by? We're lowering it by 17 grams of fat. That's crazy. Yeah, it's pretty nuts. So, like, and it's, like we said, it's more volume of food. This is my volume symbol. And you're seriously, you're gonna feel full. And you can add more lettuce and onion and pickle if you wanna make it more voluminous and fill your belly up more. Less now, fat, less calories, more way more protein. protein. It's amazing. And guys, do you see these big pants? <laughs> I am eating low calorie Big Macs and getting bigger pants. And what, this is Lululemon you're wearing, right? What, is, what size? Yeah, um, actually after I lost like the 20 pounds from the summer, the I ordered a size six Lululemon and um, when I order my next pair, I'm gonna have to order the four. I think that's the next size now. Whoa! That's pretty crazy. And like, I'm eating this stuff, guys, like seriously. This normal buns. Like. She's amazing, guys. You guys don't know how uncoordinated Nicole is. <laughs> So she's been amazing herself, flipping the spatula, flipping the buns, and actually catching them today. Spank your beam. You can't do that on YouTube. Come on. Now. If you say beam, you can because no. it's PG because the algorithm doesn't know that beam is bum. <laughs> I just told it though. Yeah, you just made the algorithm AI robot smarter. Now it's gonna come for us. Okay, now let's tell the friends something super special. If you are new to this channel, 
Sass, my husband, Kyle behind the camera, and myself have lost 130 pounds each and kept it off for six years because we eat what we like, but we choose lower calorie versions most of the time. And if you wanna know exactly what we ate to lose our first and our next 50 pounds, check out the links down below for our two weight loss guides, exact portions, exact meal plans, family-friendly recipes, we didn't take out any food groups. We ate what we liked. Check out these two videos. Make the burger and let us know what you think. Tell us about it down below. And a hula hoop, my imaginary hula hoop. I'm gonna hula hoop out for you guys. And reverse and left, to the left, to the left. Two all beef patties and special sauce. Sesame bun, I got the song wrong, but that's okay, we love it anyway, yeah. And now we're out. Phew. Don't uh, eat with the spatula that was on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> See you guys. Bye guys. Remember the friends that weight loss isn't just about the number on the scale. It's also about here and here. Heart and mindset. Fight through it. You can do it. Don't give up.